Hello, Gemini. Welcome to your love reading for June. So we're going to take a look at a couple things in regards to love for you. Please only take what resonates for you, what makes sense and fits and what you're willing to accept with this reading. Thank you so much for being here, you guys. Um, please subscribe, all that good stuff. And let's get started. All right. What do we have for Gemini? So we have the Ten of Cups, the Knight of Cups here. Two more. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. This is your past, Gemini. So... Your past relationship here, definitely getting big on family here. You guys were living together. You guys may have children together. Okay, this was someone who was very romantic, very flirty, um, very driven by their passions, emotions with you when you guys were together, when things were happy. But then I feel like certain things kind of started to either it's almost like they started to fizzle out. Communication could have been a problem. Okay. For some of you, you could have always felt like you were waiting, waiting for this person to kind of continue to put in the work into the relationship, into the family, into the home. And it might've become, it, it almost like that's what became an issue here. All right. And you guys definitely were the lovers. Okay. Had a strong bond. We're in it with each other, uh, made choices, important decisions when it came to living together, having children, the type of family and home that you wanted, okay, because you guys were in it with each other, but there was just always this, this need of uh, needing to be patient, needing to wait and communication, just not working, not coming in as it needs to. There could have also been secrets for a lot of you with your past person, a lot of things that were hidden. It's almost like this person started to shift and they were like almost like a completely different person when it came to certain things you were noticing, certain things they were doing, certain things they were saying. Again, the lack thereof of communicating here would kind of put a split um, or a distance in between keeping the security and the stability in the family or in the home. Okay, so let's see. Let's go to you, Gemini. Let's go to Gemini. Okay, Ace of Wands, Queen of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, and the Ace of Cups here. Okay, so right now your energy, Gemini, there's a lot of passion here. There's a lot of passion, and again, but staying focused on what's important. Okay, staying focused on having security, stability when it comes to your household, when it comes to your family, especially for those of you who have kids. Okay, for those of you who uh, know it's important to have someone who's going to be good with kids when that time comes, when you kind of mesh that together to make it work, to see if there can be growth there, to see if it works there, but really staying focused and happy and positive, taking good action, going for what you want. There's definitely some Someone here that you're into there's someone here there's a lot of passion here a lot of communication here okay uh, physically everything is going well again there's that passion that drive it's there it's happening it's it's there <laughs> it's working right 
and making sure that you have someone Gemini who isn't going to put everything on you I feel like that that's what's so important here having someone who isn't going to put everything on you and burden you stress you out okay switch on you but there's something new here there's a new relationship okay a new feeling of emotions that's feeling really happy and exciting for you right now a lot of you are having fun going out doing your thing you might have met someone from being out with your friends doing your thing having a good time here with the three of cups okay but again communication is going to be really important with you especially when it comes to someone trying to come in if this person cannot communicate and be open and be honest you're not going to want to deal with them because you need that kind of stability want that kind of person who is dependable and can continue to work on what's needed in a connection okay instead of just something that you feel like you're always waiting for and it's not coming in they can't you know it's like they can't retort they can't communicate with you work through it with you so there is no more of carrying a lot of burdens and having a heavy weight when it comes to what you want and the solid foundation you want for you your kids or your future family okay so a lot of fun here a lot of fun a lot of excitement and definitely love here with this ace of cups something new something exciting okay let's look at them who's this person this new person this new relationship. Oh, okay. We have justice here. Let's get more. More about them. Okay. Oh, my goodness, the Hierophant here. Okay. This is looking really good, Gemini. All right, bottom of the deck, wow. Wheel of Fortune, okay. This person, whether you have met this person or not, Gemini, <laughs> this person here, you guys, this person is going to want to really solidify. For those of you who are in a relationship, I mean, this person is, they wanna marry you. This person is full on long term commitment here. This person definitely loves to communicate to you. This person knows that you both want the same things. You have the same values. Again, when it comes to what's important, that communication, the family, the stability, the, st the security, knowing that you both are going to be there for each other. There is no more having to wait or having things prolonged because things are just getting difficult. It's about working through when things get difficult. It's about being there when times get tough and having action taken taken when it needs to be taken in order to have the growth and security that you need and have wanted and they also need and want here you both are on the same page there when it comes to commitment and it comes to the kind of uh, relationship that you want together all right this person definitely is talking a lot to you uh, there's a lot of um, longing here there's a lot of uh, <laughs> it's like this person Gemini, they know exactly where they want to go with you. Even if this person hasn't talked to you about these things yet, this is what this person is thinking about. This is what this person sees, okay? And it's like, they don't want to lose this shot with you. They're going to take it, okay? This person is very attracted to you. To them, you are it, okay? It is you. It is only you. You are fun. You are exciting. You are beautiful. I mean... What more could they want here? Definitely moving forward. Definitely moving forward together. And there's going to be so many uh, blessings and abundance that happens here for the two of you. Because what's most important, okay, with this, their energy is that they are all about truth and having that kind of commitment long term, something serious, something stable. This person knows exactly what they want and they know they want to move forward. They know they want that happiness with you. They definitely want happiness with you. 
It's all about leaving troubled times behind and what you both have been through and left behind and where you both, again, understand each other and connect as far as the values and talks about relationships, they get it and they're there because it's almost like, yeah, you both have walked away from past situations that were not good for you, that were not fulfilling you. And again, it's leading you to this moment. Abundance, happiness, togetherness, blessings. There's nothing that can stop it. When you have that sun energy here, you're moving forward no matter what. Even if things get a little unclear, you will find the path. All right, the light is shining the way. You will see it. You and this person moving forward unstoppable together. I mean, it's like this, it led to this moment. It led to this connection being fully aware, uh, having that awakening, like this is my person. This is where my excitement is. This is where my heart is. This is where my, my everything I've wanted, everything that I felt that I need and want when it comes to a relationship, this is where it's at. Yes, we need to be honest. Yes, we need to balance things out. But you can do it if you do it together. This person gets that, Gemini. There is no moon. Okay, there is no dark cloud hovering, <laughs> okay, uh, messing with vision. No, this person has a clear sight of what they want and what they want is you. So let's see, let's get more here. Okay, yeah, okay, so again, Really making things work together here is what is going to be important for the two of you. Balancing kids, okay? Balancing everything that we have to balance in life. It's like the two of you are going to be in it together. Again, there's love here. King of Cups. You guys are going to really be loving, really expressive towards each other. Really do well when it comes to making a... Uh, important decisions together again that balance here it's here no matter how their schedule is your schedule is it's like you both are going to want to do it because of how you feel about each other looking at things differently here there might be certain things in this relationship that aren't able to take off in the way that you want them to take off. You might have to take a little time here. There might be certain things that need to be done uh, in order to, it's like to move forward in a way that you both want to. And, you know, that could be many things. I'm not getting it's a negative thing here. I'm getting that there's a lot of things at play here. There's a lot of things that are important here. There's a lot of things that need to be looked into. Okay. For some of you, this person could have been married and been separated. There needs to be a divorce here before moving forward, but there is some form of, it's almost like it's halted. So let's get a little more here. One more. Yeah, but it's going to work. The communication, the love, the caring, okay? The making sure that you are protected, the making sure that you have what it is that you need, making sure your family has what it needs to move forward is important. So again, there's still a lot of things that need to be taken care of here, okay? On someone's end that might kind of halt certain things from happening, but it doesn't mean it's not going to happen. Wow, because Gemini, in the end, you and this person with all the work, all the hard work, all the needing to wait, needing to let things flow, needing to see things as they need to be, a different perspective uh, when things are halted here. But again, taking care of it, providing and doing with that passion, the drive. You guys, that work is going to pay off and you guys are going to be able to enjoy what you guys are building, what you guys are starting together. And again, love, marriage, the foundation, the being together in one roof. That's what's important here. So it's like big plans, big things happening here with the two of you. Let's get more. Yeah, this is this is definitely a connection that leads to marriage. Okay, this person thinks of this. This this is what this person wants. Let's 
There's just certain things that need to be taken care of because there's a lot going on between the two of you. But communicating and working it through is the most important thing. And I feel like both of you want to do it. And you are doing it. Okay. Yep. Okay. Wow. Boy, does this person really care about you. No matter how crazy things get, okay, Gemini, with influences on their side, things that you have going on and how it affects both of you, this person still is going to remain focused on you. When this person thinks of all the things that you're doing now and how you both are trying to make it work together, this person sees future. Again, it's it's really strong uh, marriage and commitment cards here, but this person thinks of moving ahead with you because they can see the future. Again, that sun energy. There is nothing that is confusing. There is nothing that is fearful. It may be hectic. There may be a lot, but this person, they know what they wanna do. They know where they're going. They know their route, they know their route, they know what they want. Now, back to what's going on here, which which may have you two kind of halted and kind of paused or in a way stuck. This person knows, okay? It's like this person knows that they need to work on it, but they know it's possible. This is why they're able to see ahead and think a future with you. So again, this person, it's more so their side. They have something that they need to take care of or they need to do. Okay, again, it could be a separation. It could be getting a divorce, anything, anything. But there's something that this person needs to take care of that's going to bring balance with you and them to where you both can move forward. And this person, even though they know they need to do it, this person doesn't feel like they're trapped. They just know that they, they, there's a lot that they need to do, okay, to have that path forward with you, which they know they will have. Because what is really important, again, really stable energy here. It's like you two are not playing around. There's no time for playing around. There's no time for messing around. It's either you just put in and we make it work because what's important is that we have what we need. So again, when it comes to being stuck, it comes to being halted. This person's going to work on it. This person's going to do it. It's about the action, the action to get things done and making sure you're doing things the right way with that fairness here. We have the justice, the fairness, the truth, right? The cause and effect. So there's things that need to be handled and taken care of. And this person is going to do it because they're keeping their eye on what they want you. They're not going to let go of that. They're not going to let go of the opportunity with you, the relationship with you. So communication here too. I see you guys really communicating, okay? Communicating through tough times, through gossip, through anything that may be going on that causes a little bit of um, chaos, okay? But it's not chaos to where it just brings everything down. This is just daily life. This is just having to deal with what we need to deal with to get to where we need to be. But you guys are definitely going to do it because the communication here is going to be what's important. And you guys are definitely staying focused on each other and helping each other, supporting each other. Uh, soulmate energy. Definitely soulmate energy here. Yeah, this person is all about trying to bring in balance, making sure that you both have the balance that's needed and that this person doesn't have anything keeping them stuck, keeping them tied down, keeping them away from you. That's what's important here in moving forward. So let's see. Okay. Queen of Wands. Page of Wands. Two of Swords. One more. There it is again. Look. Can't stop that fate. Can't stop this from, this relationship from moving forward. It's not going to happen. It's going to happen, Gemini. Okay. So 
communication here, you guys are going to be really strong on communication. And I feel like it's important to be really direct and be really honest about what you see moving forward with this person and what you want as far as, you know, uh, the future goes with this person. Okay. Cause I think they're going to really want to know, but again, there's going to be some good news here that comes in with you. If this person is not going to remain stuck, they're going to handle it. They're definitely going to handle it, Gemini, and let you know, this person's going to fill you in. It's almost like they've made their decision. They made their decision to move forward with you because you are who they desire. Okay. Everything is just feeling so good here and so positive here. Staying optimistic, staying positive. Okay. Working it through with each other, making, again, making important decisions with what is needed to be done to free uh, oneself, to focus on being able to offer something real, offer something true, offer something with balance. It's like coming in the right way, not coming in a mess, not coming into where things are chaotic and you make it worse. This person is trying to get through what they need to get through so they can be with you it's gonna happen it's gonna happen definitely bottom of the deck knight of wands energy this person isn't playing around not with you this person is determined this person is excited this person is ready, Gemini, to do what they need to do to make that choice, to offer stability here, to have that path forward, which they know it's there. So they're going to do it. They're focused. They're focused on what's ahead for you and them, which I love. So let's see. Let's see what we get here. We have not today, not dealing, hurt, avoiding conversation, call, person, boundaries, still angry. So this could be someone that they need to deal with. Okay. Someone really cold, someone very manipulative. Okay. This could be an ex. This could be someone they have kids with someone that's real, just likes to control everything, likes to manipulate the situation. Let's see. Karmic relationship, fleeting, triggers, turmoil, resentment, lessons, letting go, and loving you. There's definitely someone who's going to be heartbroken here. It's almost like when this person lets go and they free themselves, the someone's going to be triggered. And it's it's almost like it's they've been avoiding this person because with this person comes so much drama, comes so much gossip. They just want to be in positive energy, but they know they have to deal with this person so that it doesn't affect the relationship that they want to have in moving forward. We have deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, fleeting, loss, grieving, mourning. Yeah, there's definitely a separation here. We have, I like you. Someone likes you. Romance is blooming, fun, flirting, wanting to date, feeling very strong about how they feel about you. Cupid zero. Have faith. Love is coming in. A surprise invitation or meeting. Yeah. Really deep feelings here. Codependent, obsession, possession, controlling. There's that controlling. Has a block. See, someone has a block here. There's a block. And I feel like it's something with uh, another person. It's like it's... It, it's like a prison. It's like keeping this person trapped because someone is tied to someone. Again, it could be because this person has kids with someone. But again, this person is manipulative. This person is controlling. This person likes to depend on others for their own gain. They want people to do things for them. It's their way or the highway. But this person, it's like they're going to have a rude awakening here. Because someone is moving on. Someone has moved on. Someone has let go. And moving forward. Let's see. Stay optimistic about your love life. Almost came out. Oh, okay. Like, all right. <laughs> okay. Okay. 
One more. One more. Nope. That's it. Okay. So, we have true love here. This is the romance of a lifetime. Absolutely. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. And also, forgive, forgiving and letting go uh, certain people who have certain ties to you or you're connected to, to really just heal certain issues to move forward. Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here for you and your person. Yeah, very into each other in love with each other been hit by cupid's arrows wanting to make it work going to make it work gemini let's see We have karmic twice here. Karmic relationship. This connection serves as a catalyst to prepare you for the real high vibrational love. You are feeling very pulled to this person. There's that magnetic attraction. Okay. It appears to be the real thing, but it's not. Integrate the lessons that need to be learned. Yeah. There's definitely a strong magnetic attraction here. There's a lot that also is going to be learned from this connection and moving forward with this person. Retreat. Disconnect from the outer world a bit in order to sort out how you feel about a certain situation. Make time for yourself. This will help you gain the clarity that you need. And then quality time. Spending more time together and doing things you enjoy is important now. If you are single, this card tells you to spend more time with friends. This card highlights parties and having a good time. And a lot of you are definitely having a good time and doing your thing. what else we get here you and your person might just be wanting to get away and have time for just you just you and them spending time together leap it's time to leap out of the darkness and into the light filled with positivity staying optimistic focusing on that future together taking a leap Smile. Cheer others up with a smile. A smile goes a long way. Someone here wants you to be really happy. Again, I feel like this person wants to come in the right way. They want to move forward the right way. They want to make sure they don't have any ties that can affect you and them. This person is very determined. And wants you to be happy. They want to be able to provide for you. Oh, there we go. Okay. Just quick. What I tell you? Look at that. Look at that wedding ring, you guys. This is how deep this person feels for you. Again, commitment. Commitment is an important factor to achieve a successful relationship. Bond. A love bond grows stronger over time. Taking time with each other to make sure that everything is handled, everything is taken care of, and you both can move forward the right way with each other. All right. Being truthful, being honest, being open. Communication here, very important with how you two move forward and make decisions together with what it is that you both want. When it comes to this connection, there's a lot of healing that needs to happen here with family, family members, again, someone who's connected to someone here, 
But this person feels deeply about you. They like you. They're remaining optimistic with everything going on. Separation is not the end. <clears throat> Separation is not the end. I feel like there's someone here that's, again, I'm just, I keep thinking here. There is a separation here, but the person that either you or this person have been separated from, it's like they just don't want, it's like they still want control. It's like they try to manipulate the situation with the connection or ties that you have. And this is the person that I feel like is going to have the rude awakening. Let's get one more. If I can get it. There we go. Reciprocate. Yeah, express shared feelings, being very honest about everything going on, how you're feeling, how the situation makes you feel is going to be truly important here, Gemini. Wish, make a wish. Yeah, that's what this person is doing. You are this person's wish. You, again, are where they see their future being. It's with you. This person isn't playing around. But see, even though... There's someone here that's separated from somebody. To them, they don't feel like it's the end. They feel like they can still chime in. They can still control certain situations, halt certain situations that they don't like. It's, again, control. Codependency, being dependent. It's that kind of person that you avoid. You avoid their energy, and they might have avoided them for so long. But it's like, now I need to deal with it. As long as you two are willing to work on the issues that come up and that need to be dealt with, you both are moving forward and are going to see your way through clearly. Whether someone likes it or not, it's not their choice. It's you and this person. The romance of a lifetime here. No, you are love. This person loves you. This person thinks about you deeply. This person feels like they have a strong bond to you, a strong connection to you. Work through your feelings. A lot about expressing your feelings, Gemini. Expressing how you feel, them expressing how they feel. It's very important here because it's what's going to keep maintaining the balance that you both need with what you both um are going to be dealing with, especially if you want to be with each other. Have to put in that work, have to put in that effort and take the action with each other to get through it. So it's like this person really does want to know how you feel and they want you to express your feelings. This person cares about you a lot. There's a lot to work through here when it comes to emotion and feelings. It's like you guys are going through a lot. Going through a lot with this person because of so much going on around you. Again, it could be family issues. You know, it could be family who's causing issues here for some of you. But whatever it is, this person does care. Respect. Respecting this connection, this relationship enough to, again, come in the right way. This person knows they need to reciprocate. This person wants things to be balanced. They want to heal and work through things for those of you who are going through a rough patch with this person. With no matter whether it's gossip, drama, okay, or you guys were arguing a little bit and things just got kind of, again, um, 
communication was off, building that communication back up and working through feelings, I feel is really important here. Twin flame. <laughs> Bottom of the deck adventure, a new adventure here together. Okay. Appreciate this moment. Every situation is an opportunity to grow and find love. So no matter how hectic things get, no matter how crazy things get, know that as long as you two still communicate, put in effort and work and dedication to what you truly want and what you want to grow and expand here, as far as you two, it can work. Appreciate this moment, all that it's teaching you, all that you're learning. All that you're trying to do here for each other, with each other. Let's look at the bottom. <laughs> Embrace your emotions. A lot of you need to open up. Okay, a lot of you need your person to open up as well. Again, keep the communication consistent. Allow your feelings to surface and be accepted. You got to express how you feel. You got to let them know. If you need respect, you got to let them know. Let them know what you need and it will be accepted. This is a bond that can grow stronger over time. You have the cards here to wear. For those of you who need to need healing here or need to come together and work through all the obstacles coming up because it's getting a lot or it's becoming too much, that's what's important. Expressing emotions. There could be a block here at how you guys express to each other. But again, I see you, I see you guys moving forward. Let's see. Definitely moving forward and focused on happiness together in abundance. But again, it's going to take communicating. It's going to take that spark, building that spark back. Be fun. Have fun. Don't forget to let loose a little bit. All right. With all the things that's going on, sometimes you just have to unwind. You have to relax and you have to just say, screw it. I need, we just need to spice it up. Have a little fun. Have a little release. Okay, when things are very crazy, but still express how you feel. And if you need them to express how they're feeling, let it be known. Okay, that's what I'm getting here for you guys. So Gemini, thank you so much for watching you guys. Um, please like, subscribe, all that good stuff that helps the channel and helps get the message out to those who need to hear it. Again, thank you again so much, you guys. I'll see you the next video. Bye.